All right, so we already got the team here. You can see, if you go look at the guy in the Adidas hat, you got uh, Rowdy Jordan, and then you got bottom left, you got Brandon's best. Bottom left, if you could go bottom left right there. That's Kellum Clark, who is a Brandon native, hit a big home run in the College World Series. So we got a lot going on, a lot of people. I'd love to show you behind, but we actually have some fans that are with us. What Names, up, real quick. My name is Peter Bushman. I'm a student here. I'm Will Johnson. I'm also a student. All right, so talk about, you know, obviously as a student, you know, watching the first ever national champion. Oh. I mean, it's, it's unbelievable to be a part of this. You know, the city, this whole school, the program, it's so much history. Um, in so many years, we've gone to Omaha and to finally be a part of a year where we bring it home. It just means so much, for real. Yeah. I've, I've been a lifelong fan, too, and for it to finally happen, it's been a long time coming. I love it. Yeah, well, thank you guys for joining us. We'll let you uh, go uh, celebrate how you want to. Again, let's get another shot at the players on the bus. Now, they're going to head down University Drive all the way to Duty Noble. Uh, it's a huge celebration here. You can hear the cowbells. You got cheerleaders. You got the fire trucks with the new paint. We'll check back in with you later in the show. Uh, we're going to send it over to Marcus right now who is in the con district where i hear that it's really wild as well marcus yeah big day here for people in starkfield listen i'm actually excited we're going to pan the camera around just so you guys can see people are already filing in yeah. as you can see they are excited to see these bulldogs come in but we're going to talk to john real quick hey john listen we're excited to be talking to you today listen is this your first time participating yes sir how does it feel to be a part of this big moment exciting so what's, what's what do you think your favorite part is going to be today mm, probably seeing uh the players and and that's all john who do you have with you today uh my friend branson and his dad and his siblings okay branson branson tell us what's your favorite part going to be today probably the parade in general so we can already hear people excited. We're going to pan the camera around one more time just so you guys can hear. They're yelling maroon and white. Listen, guys, they are excited to be here today. Of course, we'll have much more coverage on our website, WJTV.com, as well as on air. Stay tuned. Now I'm going to toss it over to Tal. Well, hey guys, earlier I talked to you about fans just waiting in line for hours to get the best spot in the house and just take a look at this. Just some of the most devoted fans here. But I also have here, before we toss the package, our youngest fans cheering on their devoted Bulldogs. State University fans packed Duty Noble Field this time around for a much different, bigger reason marking MSU baseball history. I'm really glad we finally pulled one out. I did not think I'd be alive for it. It's been the 12th time the Bulldogs have been part of the College World Series. And on Wednesday, the first time the Hale State has won it all. After the Oma Dogs beat at Vanderbilt University in the three-game championship series in Omaha, Nebraska this week. So we went crazy whenever we saw that they were about to like win We've the whole always thing. always been a great ball team, yes. so we were just excited that it finally happened. <laughs> Among the excited fans is Sue Davin. She waited in line for nearly three hours, traveling from Madison to cheer on her Bulldogs to the point of exhausting her voice. Combination of one super regional was super, super hot. And then the next day it was super, super cool. So I think it's a combination of the two and screaming at the TV. But like other fans here, nothing is keeping them from honoring the 2021 Diamond Dogs on their championship to win the College World Series. We're ready to cheer loud. We're ready to cheer loud, ring the cowbells, and hail state, man. <laughs> Parade honoring baseball championship kicks off in less than an hour. Now the parade culminates with an event inside Duty Noble Field. School officials say where head coach Chris Lamonis will be honored for helping lead the Bulldogs to victory. We're now live inside Duty Noble Field. We're take it to Melanie in the studio. Now, thank you. How exciting. Well, we're going to bring you live coverage of this evening's parade in Starkville live. Once it gets underway, we expect it to roll at about 5.30, and you can watch it live again right here on 12 News.